In the middle of selling an heiress's house, a well-known New York City realtor leaped to his death from his Upper East Side apartment building. Tuesday soon before 7.30 a.m., Tom Cooper, 56, struck the pavement in front of 18 East 67th Street, near Madison Avenue. Terrified witnesses claim that before they noticed a body, they mistook the impact for a laundry bag. There was a suicide note, according to the police. When he passed away, the Douglas Elliman realtor was selling the $3.7 million apartment that billionaire Oracle founder Larry Ellison's daughter, director Megan Ellison, occupied inside the former NYPD headquarters on Center Street. Cooper was pictured in the foyer of the historic building that housed the apartment and two others he was selling, with a Christmas tree in the background of his most recent social media ad. He posted on Friday, saying, the gorgeous lobby of the police building at 240 Center Saint. Additionally, Cooper recently assisted in the $18.5 million sale of a six-story, 9,000-square-foot townhouse located at 24 West 10th Street. I'm overjoyed that my amazing buyers may now call this elegant Greenwich Village brownstone home. He posted on Instagram, saying, Truly a stunning house, and part of New York City history. To be with her devastated family and friends, Cooper's sister is traveling to New York City. Witnesses claimed that after only a few days of seeing Cooper, one of his agitated neighbors fled the Upper East Side building. The witness told the New York Post, a neighbor came out and said he just spent Christmas Eve with him, and he had said that it was the best Christmas Eve he had ever had. Cooper lived in apartment 4A on the fourth story, and from the street below, a partially open window was visible. It is thought that Cooper leaped from this level. Blood was seen on the pavement in photos taken at the location about this died. Cooper was taken by first responders to a neighboring hospital where they declared him dead. Up until 1973, Cooper served as the primary agent for Megan Ellison's Center Street apartment and as well as two other agents within the landmark 1909 building that housed the NYPD headquarters. Supermodels Cindy Crawford and Lindra Von Gillisto lived there, along with renowned fashion designer Calvin Klein, after it was converted into opulent apartments. The 1,770-square-foot apartment on the top floor includes a large bedroom that is dominated by a towering rotunda-style home. Cooper's listing said that for a total of $7.2 million, it could be bought with the two-bedroom. 1,550 square foot, $3.5 million apartment next door. In addition, he was asking slightly under $6.5 million for a third floor flat with three bedroom. Dating back to 1905, Cooper's own opulent building is comprised of eight separate residential flats. One unit was rented for $9,000 per month in 22. Cooper is the most recent New Yorker to leap in recent weeks from upscale Manhattan buildings. Alina Page, a 35-year-old Russian mother of two, perished last week after plunging from the Brittany, a high-rise near Mayor Eric Adams' Gracie Mansion apartment. A 47-year-old man committed suicide by jumping from the Gotham Hotel in Midtown in October. During the summer, two days later, three guys who had committed suicide passed away. One of those men leapt from an opulent high-rise and died. Please visit Suicide Prevention Liflin or, or give the Suicide Prevention Hotline a call at 988 if you or someone you know is experiencing suicidal thought.